Hey guys, today on DNS Projects, you'll see right there, we got the old Dodge Pro Prospector. We're gonna be doing a, a oil change, oil change on that. Let's see what we're gonna be using right here. This has got the three, uh, 318 motor in it. it takes 4.7 liters. So we'll go through uh, how to do the oil change. There's your filter number. We're using the Amsoil products. I will link in the description to that below and uh, more details on it. If you want to get a hold of me or set up any type of account, we can do that for you. All right, you can see this truck's already running AMS oil, so we're going to just jump down below, drop that dipstick. <clears throat> we'll check the transmission fluid while we're here. Maybe we'll add that to his list for the next time. Here's going to be your uh, dipstick right here. So let's crawl underneath, grab that uh, drain plug and cracks are open. You see the drain plug right there, and that's gonna be a half inch. This one was pretty tight, which tells me uh, she was over tightened. And it also looks like we got uh, some leakage going on here, maybe out of the filter wasn't tightened enough. So we'll go ahead and make sure that that's uh, changed up for him. <clears throat> All right, here we go. We're gonna wave the dipstick off, pull it out so we can check the oil. Then she goes right in there, right beside the valve cover. We got our signature series uh, 040. 040, uh, you can also use the 1030 or 5W30. We are gonna use this, takes 4.7 liters. And there you go. There's your uh, liquid gold. So we'll go ahead and add these drain plugs in, filters tightened up. And that's what we're running. And we'll do the diff oil after this. It's uh, pretty hard to see. She's right on the full line there. You want to make sure that you're not over full because your engine oil will break down faster. So that's it. That's all there is to it. Inch and a half drain plug. Pop that off. Get yourself a filter wrench. Pull your filter. Throw your oil in through the drain or through the uh, fill cap there on the side of your valve cover. And then we'll go ahead and show you how to do the diff. All right, so here we are underneath the diff. You're gonna need some silicone sealer. So I'm gonna go ahead, wipe that out of there. Actually looks like it was fairly decent, fairly clean. So we'll go ahead and uh, clean that up and then put some new silicone around this baby. So oh, there's your silicone, nothing fancy. Throw that on. All right, so we got the Amsoil easy pour bags. Let's see if we can do this with just one hand. Oh, she's tricky, but it's nice. You can just tip it up however you want, pour it in there. Hardest part is uh, clipping the end and taking off the little paper plug. Love the easy pour bags. If you're interested in the Amsoil products, uh, go to amsoil.com or amsoil.ca, or I'll have the links in the descriptions for the preferred customer accounts and whatnot. Or you can send me a message and we can uh, give you my email and uh, a little bit of information and I'll set you up a preferred customer account for free. Uh, you can get a hold of me. I'll have my email in the descriptions or just uh, message me and uh, We'll set you that up, gives you 25% off, or just go on a, online, use my referral number, 3021-3198. Thanks for watching DNS Projects. If you wouldn't mind going down to that like and subscribe button.